The Crow Wing Food Co-op in Brainerd has made some changes to provide safety for workers and elderly shoppers. Board members are looking forward to relocating to a much larger location that would allow customers to shop safely. Chantel Calhoun has our story. Due to the pandemic, staff members at the Crow Wing Food Co-op in Brainerd are allowing only 10 shoppers in at a time to safely social distance. We've initiated a 10 person limit in our co-op. So if things are busy, we do uh, lock the door until a person leaves and sort of ratio who can come in at one point in time. But we do temporarily close our store um, each Tuesday, typically in the morning while we receive a big delivery that enables our staff to process that delivery and get it unpacked quickly and safely without having to also help customers at that time. Workers are required to wear masks and have reserved early morning shopping to accommodate the elderly. We have slightly reduced hours. We're open right now um, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. on the weekdays and then 10 to 5 on weekends. And we do reserve that first hour of shopping for people who are immunosuppressed or elderly or vulnerable in any other way. So um, so we have implemented some safety measures too, to, in addition to regular cleaning and that sort of thing to try to keep our people safe. Crow Wing Food Co-op Sills plans to relocate downtown, which will provide a much larger space for shoppers. We just signed a lease at the property we've had our eyes on for months, so that's been very good. Um, we signed a lease at the 624 Laurel Street property at the corner of 7th and Laurel downtown Brainerd. It was the former hockey house and before that downtown Art and Frame. So we're very excited about that. That uh, that space has 3,500 square feet in the front area. And then we're carving out another 500 square feet in the back area, also where we will have a dry storage area, a public restroom and an office back there. So um, we'll be moving into a space this summer with 4,000 square feet, which is a big increase from our 900 square feet currently. Reporting in Brainerd, Chantel Calhoun, Lakeland News. To become a member or to help support the move into downtown Brainerd, you can visit the website you see on the screen. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.